So joining me after the 3-2 penalty shootout defeat to the Basing State Bison, I've got man of the match, Jordan Maher. I've got captain James Ferrara. Jordan, that, that's a frustrating way to finish the, the evening. I thought the Phantoms uh, gave as good as they got. There was barely a fag paper between the two sides tonight. That was pretty close. It's pretty, <coughs> pretty frustrating. Yeah. Jimmy, one point out of four, I suppose, is the way we look at it. But some perspective is that we're games behind in terms of what we've played. Still lots of hockey to play down the stretch. Uh, a lot of disgruntled, dis disappointed faces on the team, but uh, uh, we're still in a great position. Uh, and, and you could perhaps sum up 2018. It's been a, a good couple of weeks. Yeah, it has. Uh, the year in general has been good. I think every other team in the league would take the position we're in right now. Um, so we are still in a, in a great position. We're games in hand on all the teams. And I think we're tied with Swindon at the top of the league um, in terms of points at the moment. But obviously games are uneven at the moment. But we're in a great position. Every other team would take the position that we're in right now. So it's all in our hands at the moment. You know, the next few weeks are important for us. Um, but in terms of 2018 and heading into 2019, start of the season, start of the camp, I think you'd take the position we're in now. Um, you know, we're, we're effectively first as long as we win, you know, a game, at least one of those games in hand. And then uh, we see what, what, what happens with the cup and everything else. But, you know, we've, we, we've already won one trophy this season. Um, and it's disappointing that we couldn't end 2018 on a high. Um, it was disappointing. Um, I, think, I think overall we were the better team tonight. We just didn't take our chances when they came. But they're a good team. You know, they worked hard to the end. Killed penalties really well, I thought. Um, and that could have been the difference tonight. And it's one of those things sometimes. Yeah, I think it's. Uh, I think the penalty killing w was good. I mean, we had we had the opportunities. Jordan, just a word, a final word, perhaps on tonight. I, I think over the or over the series, we'd, you'd like to split the series with the big teams, with Swindon, with with Basingstoke. It's two each in the league at the moment, so it, it, it's still all to play for. Yeah, there's plenty of games to play. Right, the league's no one until you can't be caught. So. Next week's a tough one. Uh, London Raiders, they've been on a good run of form. I think it's away on Saturday and uh, and on Sunday it's... Um, is, it here? is it London Raiders here? I think it is. Uh, the, the games come thick and fast, don't they? Yeah, uh, two huge games next week and uh, we'll be out to get more than the one point over the weekend and start 2019 in the right way. Um, I think over the weekend we've, we've worked hard enough to, to have picked up more points. Sometimes it just doesn't go your way and that's what we've done to pretty much all the teams up to this point so far this season so you know you're not going to win them all and you're going to go through patches through the season where perhaps things don't go away maybe tonight just didn't um, but it's one of those things you know it's this is no one individual's fault I think as a team we we did enough to win the game and just unfortunate tonight um, it's one of those things and we look forward to next weekend good luck on the performances next weekend we'll, we'll see you next week Thank you.